Paul, you're you're British, aren't you? <laughs> oh, no, I'm Irish. <laughs> Hello, I'm Paul Meskell, and today I'm here with Chris Riley. Oh my God, he's nominated for an Emmy. He's okay. Hello, I'm Paul Meskell, and today I'm here with Chris Riley and Alex Murphy, and we are playing a quiz called "How Well Do You Know Me?" quiz that is going to put their friendship to the test. How well do you think you guys know each other? We know each other well, very yeah. well. I met this handsome man. Never went to college up in Dublin. I'd say myself and Alex know each other very, very well. My first question, Alex, what was yeah. the worst thing that Chris did at school? Photobombing every class photo on picture day, bombing and farting at the same time, <laughs> or drilling a hole in my finger by accident. What does that mean, bombing and farting? Puking and farting Puking. at the same time, like. Bombing? No, <laughs> vomiting. That would definitely be the worst thing you did. What? I bombed and farted at the same time. I do know this one, because it's so funny. It, it, this needs to be in a film. He jumped into every school photo, class photo, in different, like, costumes. Alex, you got it right. Come on, Alex. What's the fly? There's a fly in his the house. Fly. He's not actually here, you see. Chris, what happened at Alex's devs? <laughs> was it one, threw up on his maths teacher? Jesus, what? Two, received a hand shandy in the club group. Three, filled mate's pants up with chicken nuggets. Well, if the second one's true, I don't think you'd reveal that of yourself. So I'm gonna go with the chicken nuggets in the pants. <laughs> it's the chicken nuggets! That's <laughs> so odd. We went back to one of the lads' houses out in Carrigaline and uh, he passed out. I won't, I won't say his name. What is Chris's TV guilty pleasure? Is it one, Love Island, to Miranda. Three UK border force. If there's one thing Chris loves, it's UK border force. <laughs> Don't we all? I know, I've walked in on him one too many times watching Love Island, so uh, I'm gonna go with Love Island. Correct. What's your guilty pleasure, Paul? Um, my guilty pleasure is UK border force. <laughs> no, I have no idea. What is my guilty pleasure? The one where the crab fishing. Getting thrown around in the waves. Yeah. Big catch, big catch, yeah. yeah. <laughs> With the waves. Yeah. You were last night. I like, yeah. <laughs> For the record, I was last night. What is Alex's biggest pet peeve? Bus drivers who don't say hello, people eating with their mouths open, people touching him when you tell a story. I know what this is as well. I'm telling a story. I poke him all the time. That's it, is it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. correct. Yeah. Alex, what was Chris's first job? Shop assistant Debenhams. <laughs> A Santa's little helper, <laughs> or working at the stable? Uh, it was Debenhams. Correct. Oh, <laughs> I wish he was Santa's little so helper. So do I. My first job, I played Tiny Tim in this in this play called uh, Mrs. Bob Cratchit's Wild Christmas Binge. And the funny thing is, Alex could still play Tiny Tim. <laughs> what was your first job? I worked in a max hall. In a garage. Did you? Yeah, that was my first gig. I could see you covered in grease. Like, no, no, no. I wish that was the actual image, but it was like me in a bright blue Maxal polo. Like, I used to pretend that the ice cream machine didn't work. Well, if a kid came in and asked you for an ice cream, you'd say, because, sorry, the machine's well, if you, broken. If you agree to that, then you're opening up the floodgates, and then you have to make ice creams all day. But he could you see it there, you scumbag. I know, it's, I'm not proud. You're going to get cancelled because of that. Chris. Which of these statements are in Alex's Wikipedia? Alex is considered the best looking of the Young Offenders lads. In 2019, he was named one of GQ's 50 best dressed men. Three, Murphy began a modeling career as a toddler before acting. It does say in Wikipedia, Alex Murphy is considered the best looking of the two. Hey, look, I don't, I don't make the rules, all right? It's bullshit, man, you definitely wrote this. Alex, who was Chris's childhood crush? Cruella de Vil, Fiona Bruce <laughs> or Tracy Beaker? Tracy Beaker. No, Cruella Deville. She be kinky, like. <laughs> yeah. Your gaff would stink. The microphone for me is like way over by this laptop, so you might get a bit of projection. No, darling, I don't project. I went to Rada, darling. <laughs> so, Alex fucked up there. Chris is ahead by one. Chris, what is Alex's secret talent? Saying the alphabet backwards. No. Afro beats dancing. Holding breath underwater for 87 seconds. What is Afro beats dancing? Oh, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah is yeah, it? That's it. I'm gonna say, I'm saying it's I'm gonna hold your breath for 87 seconds underwater. Alphabet backwards. You can't do that. If he doesn't get this right, he's been docked two points. It's back to level pegging. Three, two, one. Z Y X W V U T S R Q P O N M L K J H G F E D C B A. 
can't believe that that's actually come into practice because whenever I was like 12, my dad, my dad said he'd give me 20 quid if I could learn the alphabet backwards. That, is, that was very That was impressive. What is Chris's secret talent? Speed rope skipping, shadow puppetry, knowing every line from the first episode of Father Ted. I happen to know Chris has won many a competition for his skills at skipping. Correct answer. And funnily, you should say that because it says here, and then Paul pulls out a rope and offers it to Chris that I didn't even know I had in my pocket that was given to me about 10 seconds ago. Do you have a rope? I just said it Oh, it's a bad yeah. start. That's speed, that is speed skipping. That's ridiculous. I'm gonna, I'm gonna now, as a result of that, Put you both on le level pegging. Oh. I actually didn't know this was the last question. There is a bonus point, and it is the Paul Mescal round. I'll think of something. Okay. <laughs> Which of these isn't a name of my dog? Z. Are you okay? <laughs> You're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> my leg is so sore. Colin. Jack, Bob, I gave nothing away well, there. Did, no, I did. Three, two, one. Bob. Bob. I have a dog called Bob. It was Jack. I have a it dog called Colin, Jack. Boy. It was Colin. Yes, Chris Colin. wins, he got there yes. first. Oh, Alex, oh, you're oh, a oh, you later, man. Look, Thanks I don't make man. the rules. I do not that's, make the rules. The fact of the matter is, and being deadly serious, these two gentlemen love each other and please, watch their show because they're extraordinarily talented. Extraordinarily talented. Thank you, Paul. You're very welcome. That was very earnest. But it's the truth. No, yeah, it's the truth.